G'day everybody and welcome to Dog Shadow Gaming. As always, I'm Belf on the channel where all we do is play Warhammer of any kind. So, <laughs> we're basically in a Warhammer Fantasy, 40k, you name it. If it's on a game, we'll play it. If it's on a console or a PC, it'll be on this channel. We provide, uh, uh, well, plays, guides, reviews, the whole shebang. So stay tuned for our second episode of our Necron uh, Battlefleet Gothic Armada 2 campaign right after this. And we're back. All right. Fantastic. Now, on our last episode, we managed to leave it. Uh, we had just destroyed the chaos up here and we got to claim the sector, which was nice. Uh, it does put us a little bit over here, though, doesn't it? Uh, we may need to defend this one. So, uh, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. We'll put both of those in here on this one. And we're pretty much right to go. I think we can... Oh, we can we can get one fleet. So what do we want? Um, mass Recall, Scarab Swarm, Resurrection Orb, which is cool. Or, and Stasis Bomb, Resurrection Orb, and Mass Recall. Scarab... I like Scarabs. Hmm. Yeah, let's... Oh, hang on. We don't have the cash. I have 131. Okay, so we'll get that in the next turn. Did we... Did we have another one? No, we did not have another one. Okay. 2316 and 288 here. Um, we're pretty much just going to sit pretty now. And that's the end of the turn. I hope you enjoyed the first episode of the Necron campaign, guys. Um, good to see you here for the second one. Uh, also, make sure you check out the Tyranids campaign. Uh, and the Imperial... The Empire, I suppose. The Imperial uh, Navy as well. Um, we'll have all three of the campaigns up on the channel. As well as PvP action as I am streaming the PvP. I'm taping the campaign just because it's easy to tape the campaign and put it into cool chunks for um, YouTube. But um, I'm streaming the PvP mostly. It's just a little bit more thematic to watch live. And interact with so if you uh, do like the pvp aspect of the game or are intrigued then do check out the links on the about tab on the youtube page um or in the comments below on bitshoot and check out the or comments below in the, in the video even and check out the twitch channel um i've just made affiliate and so i'm only streaming there at the moment so we're gonna come down here and and we should can we get a new ship yet i think we should be able to get a new ship yes we can okay we can but we're gonna have to oh man okay so go maybe for that one that one which leaves us 49 which is 51 points which is still over so you kind of like you might as well go that and just be done with it 397 uh, this guy i think oh we've got cash anyway Hang on, we removed him. I want to put him back. Okay. Apparently you can't. That's a bit silly. That's a bit silly. Why can you not put them back? You can't swap them in and out. That seems really dumb. Okay. 
end the turn. Uh, yeah, so uh, also uh, remember to smash the thumbs up guys if you're enjoying the stuff. Uh, I usually ask at the end, but uh, people either haven't watched all the way to the end or they have forgotten. So I'm asking now, please do hit the thumbs up button. It certainly helps the channel out a lot. It's fine. Going after this one. Yeah, we should definitely leave one of these guys with... I can't put any more of those, that's the problem. That's a bit rubbishy. They need to look at that for the campaign. So you can either give up on... Oh, uh, yeah, I suppose, because you're going to have the two here. Uh, but I can't... What can I do here? Then? Got any upgrades we could do? Not entirely. Oh, hello. Tall wheel up there. And we still need to put that up there, okay. That's right. It's probably worth doing the turn anyway. Not quite strong enough to take on any of them at their base. They need to come out. Oh, we'd be at pretty distinct disadvantages going in. So, right now, we're better off just upgrading what we can and getting our income up a little bit. One of them wants to make a move pretty soon, you'd think. Well, that's as upgraded as I can get, right? Next one is to start a new fleet, right? So to get a third fleet, get one of these guys here. Okay, so. wasn't lightning link creates a lightning link between the ships and ship and an ally necron ship maximum to 9,000 units enemy ships caught in the lightning suffer 60 damage per second ignoring armor the link lasts for 20 seconds unless the link ships separate for more than 10 seconds that's pretty cool can't see it can't say it working much in um uh, in uh Need to just end the turn for one turn. Okay. Should be able to add something now. One more turn. Actually, probably should have some form of escort, shouldn't we? Yeah, okay, let's do this guy with Escort, so we've actually got some. Okay. Like the sector view. Right. Okay, from here, let's go get... And only put two in. I can't put the three in. And they're not moving. It really annoys. Somewhat. Okay. Um... Uh... too bad we're pretty even actually let's do this hmm 
Okay, all right. So Black Legion and Iron Warriors. Very nice. All right. Uh, Cruiser Clash by the looks of it. Where is the rest of my guys? I'm missing a guy. Why am I missing a guy? So I did this before where sort of one would come in a bit later. I really don't understand why they're doing this. It doesn't make much sense. Uh, okay, we're gonna use. All right, running. Why am I missing a ship? I do not understand why this is happening. As you command. Relocating. We use uh, oh. adopting defensive protocol. We use reactive hulls for this one. Got to outlast. Since for some reason we haven't brung all of our troops, I cannot understand yes, why that. It must be a bug. as far away from these as we can.
is to spare. What is your command? I'm gonna speed this up a little bit because it's kind of like. Hurry up! Kill him already.
All right. Took us a while though. Like it was pretty slow going. I had to speed that up and it was still took a while. Not well, I'm not really understanding why not all my battleships are going into the into the field. This really doesn't make much sense. Like one gets left out every time for some reason. Must be a, a major uh, bug with the uh, with the campaign. Can't be right. Round rank two. Okay, not too bad. We get a fleet capacity plus one. We everything goes up by fifty points, which isn't too bad. Um, and we manage to get ourselves. Let's get our fleet first. Uh, there you go. It's our fourth fleet. Uh, now. You first, my man. Oh, we'll have to wait a turn. Okay. Oh, all right. Get our main dude here. He took a bit of a took a bit of a beating, didn't he? Uh, revoke ship, remote to flagship. Okay, cool. Uh, fleet power. Yeah, okay. So what cash have we got? One forty nine. Wait another turn. Cool, all right. Hundred and twenty seven coming in, which isn't too bad. Round world. Or will do okay, strategic positioning, yeah. Hello, what have we got here? Not quite, okay. Number 57, we're slowly getting it to go up a little bit. Just before we majorly increase our fleet, we need to just buff up our infrastructure a little bit. Uh, we should do that too major world. Uh, looks like we're going to get invaded here. Would that be fun? And let's take that one there too. Okay. 23. Okay, down he comes. You're about to get wasted, my man. All right, we'll wrap this one up quickly and yeah, smash him up and then maybe take the one above it. Again, guys, if you're liking what you're seeing, do hit the thumbs up and uh, it really helps the channel. I cannot tell you enough. Uh, the likes really seem to be working with the YouTube algorithm. Um, so if you hit the likes, it does help me out quite a lot. Or you could share the video too. That would be really cool. Um, as a, a small... Uh, YouTube channel it's really hard to get out there because uh, the way the algorithm works look if you don't know it basically promotes everyone who's already got a massive audience forward um, oh cool so we got we've got some defensive points we'll take that one and that one so we just need to go up forward stick together again I have a massive fleet here why am I not controlling my fleet I, what's the point in me having this fleet if they're gonna be piecemeal brought in I really don't like this mechanic. It's, uh, it's a little bit irritating. All power to motive units. Um, I might as well have just autoed it. Because I had the I had the massive fleet advantage, and I'd like to use my fleet, but I can't because they won't let me use it all. Obviously, when one dies, the next one comes in. What's the point? The engine should be able to cop with a lot more than this. You have seen Way more than this. Area. 
You have seized a strategic area. Usually you only do this sort of thing if you're like pushing your engine's limits and it's going to start chugging up the system or whatever, but it shouldn't be the case in this at all. You wouldn't think anyway. All right, what do we got? Oh, we got our chain link here. We can uh, we can play with that. It's not him. Who is it? It's this guy. I serve your glory. What is your command? The enemy has seized a strategic area. the first battle where I've actually had defenses at, which is cool. Ready to serve. How may I serve? I am the dearest spear. You have seized a strategic area. seized a strategic area. Jammed up on him here. That's that, guys. Death by an um, 
A lot of electric beams. A lot of green electric beams. Righty-o. Cool, all right. Um... Pretty much full. Send you up there. Pretty much full. Send you up there. Okay, so Red Corsairs, radio 440 against now 686. So this should be pretty straightforward. But again, we're not going to get to use all of our ships. So, hmm. Okie dokie. Uh, it's just a cruiser clash. Cool. All right. Straightforward enough. Bring Terra on scene. I'll try and get this the chain going this time. A little bit better. Big detection ring, isn't it? What is your command?
Oh, that works well, doesn't it? What is your command? Stay in there, that's my command. Relocating. See if we can get this chain up and going. Again. I 
I serve your glory. Adopting defensive protocols. Impossible. Cannot comply. Energy to weapons array. What is your command? How may I serve? We are death. Ready to serve. On the march. They are doomed. Let's speed this up now. That's that. So the chain link was pretty good. Uh, where we got it working, it's uh, tough to mark, it's tough to land, but wow, did it do some damage. I can't see it being great in multiplayer, but... Um, Too bad for here. Okay, well, one more. Okay, well, that one's pretty much upgraded. Don't need any more there. One more to upgrade there. That one's done. One more there. And then we've got a, quite a few here that need upgrading by the looks of it. Uh, yeah, okay, cool. One more. All right, so we got two ships on either side now and we're looking pretty good. Okay, and that'll do it uh, for this episode. As always, guys, do smash the thumbs up if you enjoyed it, like really, <laughs> it helps. So please do do that. Uh, if it's your first time for the channel, then please do hit the subscribe. Um, hopefully you're enjoying all of this uh, Battlefleet Gothic Armada 2 um, campaign, the Necrons campaign. Uh, I think that's about it, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Remember, the Emperor protects. See you guys. Bye. Yeah, yeah.